I can't be in here. Let's uh, double back. I don't know what this is. Could be interesting. So I'll venture inside a bit. You can see here rows of uh, small trees growing. These were uh, the tables, an abandoned house. And there's a dog inside, so hello there. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna take you to that uh, other part of that 100 plus years orchard, which as you can see is a bit more uh, taken care of. This is an apple orchard here. And uh, last time I came here, about uh, a year ago, I thought I, I can't be in here. So uh, after coming here a couple of days and uh, realizing that there's no harm uh, in coming inside, I decided to show you around. So come on, let's go. Yeah, as I said, this is uh, an 100 plus years orchard. It was uh, way bigger a hundred years ago, but now with the expansion of uh, department stores, which you can see here, this is uh, Selgros's backyard. Of course, there's a chopper flying because we're uh, kind of close to the airport, right, right about there. In a diagonal line is uh, our like airport. Yeah. So uh, I'm gonna take you exploring and uh, we're gonna see some interesting things. I'll make a left turn here first. This street has a, a dead end and a barrier, but uh, we're still gonna go at the end. This is some part of uh, the orchard. Also, you can see trees here planted in a row for uh, quite some uh, distance. These are also apples, from what I can see. This is a tractor, which is uh, used to clean up the orchard. And uh, right back here is Bavaria Automobiles, a dealer of uh, BMW and Mini. Let's uh, double back. It's still quite chilly, even if uh, the sun is out and still windy. It is what it is. I'm gonna make a left turn and continue on this uh, straight alley here. This is a KTM dealership here, hidden away. They have dirt bikes and uh, all sorts of motorbikes. This is one part of the orchard. I don't know what this is. Maybe some of you in the comments which uh, are familiar with uh, orchard procedures can tell me where this, uh, what this uh, big hole is. You can... Uh, climb inside it through that uh, staircase there but I don't know where it is dirt road here leads into that part of the orchard which I showed you earlier but uh, now we are on the other side as you can see there's the Bavaria dealership and uh, right back there where uh, you can see through those, through that tight space, through the trees, there are cars zooming past because it's uh, the national road number one, which you might uh, remember from my videos also. I put a link for uh, all the videos I'm mentioning in the description below. So if you're new to the channel, you can check them out. Now we come to an interesting part here. The gate is wide open and uh, let me check this out first. This right here is what remains from uh, a big greenhouse. I don't know what uh, they used to plant here and grow, but uh, as you can see, it was uh, reclaimed by nature. All of this structure made out of uh, metal and glass. Now maybe those, uh, those panels there are plastic, but I think they were uh, added. But the main structure, it was built from uh, metal and uh, glass, as you can see. I'm gonna continue here and uh, be very careful so that I don't get a puncture. This is uh, also interesting. I'm gonna leave my bike here for a bit to show you inside. I don't usually do this, but uh, it's kind of safe. You can see here all this, uh, all these storing containers 
were uh, for seeds. This one is dated 1995. They're, uh, they're empty. This is an annexed building. There's a uh, power here, but uh, I don't know what what actually is uh, working. And I'm gonna keep on continuing here just a little bit. This is a media advertising warehouse, some wooden uh, shelves, old wooden shelves by the look of it, here also. And uh, it says uh, toxic products and it shows the danger sign. So uh, we're not gonna venture inside another office, I presume, with a chair and a table. Yeah, I don't know what exactly is going on here. The remains of uh, some trees inside. This is another uh, greenhouse. I wonder if I can uh, ride through here. I haven't tried this before, let me get my bike. Could be interesting. I also gotta be careful because uh, I don't know exactly if uh, this building is uh, guarded or not. And I also don't wanna get a puncture, as I told you. And uh, as you can see, this is a very big uh, greenhouse here. So I'll venture inside a bit. This is what remains. You can see here the tables uh, used for uh, planting. I don't know what you do when you're gardening. And uh, it's quite large quite large yeah made a pause because I heard some uh, crackling noise like a branch inside here is the same thing it's like a, an abandoned Arboretum in here some uh, Weird vibes as you can see it's all made of uh, glass A lot of glass here also there's uh, glass on the ground Ha huh, there's uh, that chopper again from uh, earlier This uh, here has a padlock and some uh, stickers on it. No photos and uh, no entrance. I don't know if I uh, wanna exit on that other side because uh, down there, there's a lot of broken glass. So uh, I'm gonna turn back and uh, keep on exploring another part. made this left turn. There's those uh, buildings I was in. Interesting, they're uh, in such a state of decay. Keep on going. So, see what's out here. There's uh, some smaller greenhouses. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, there's some uh, smaller greenhouses here. Yeah, interesting. We continue through here on this uh, alley. See where this goes. I'm guessing uh, it's gonna dead end somewhere. But for now, I wanna keep exploring. Okay, so uh, we're not uh, entering through here. There's a uh, another row of uh, greenhouses here that uh, same type 
made of uh, metal and glass as you can see they're uh, also abandoned i don't know if you can see that black thing over there it's part of uh, was part of the irrigation system for the greenhouse let me go around this uh, plant here As far as I can see, there's an active area here. All these trees are uh, growing here and they are all labeled. Yeah, you can see those uh, little white pieces of uh, plastic paper are all uh, labeled. As far as I know, this uh, orchard has existed here since uh, the time of uh, the monarchy in Romania. I don't know exactly the date, but I'm gonna put it on screen. some other buildings here there's that uh, continuing row of greenhouses back here and uh, this is quite a newer building I presume there's a security sensor with a light yeah it's quite a newer building I'm gonna keep on uh, going as much as I can without uh, disturbing anything and anyone there's another entrance to that row you seen back there of uh, greenhouses and on my uh, left here there are uh, beehives all of these rows here of uh, beehives Let's see where this uh, alley goes. I'm guessing back here is something else, which uh, I haven't seen before. That's interesting. I haven't seen this on that uh, other part, but maybe they had it and uh, because the glass was broken and uh, the trees were much more present than here and much more bigger this uh, air duct I think it's an air duct I presume it's an air duct there's uh, one here and one there an abandoned uh, car wheel this is an electrical transformer building and uh, I'm not gonna keep continuing but at the end of this uh, alley is uh, a fence and uh, after that fence there are cars it's an auto service this part of the orchard here is still active unlike that uh, other part that i explored last year this year is uh, still planted and uh, taken care of which is very nice they have so uh, so little uh, land compared to what they had once this is part of uh, an irrigation system here and you connect the hose so you can uh, water all these plants there's uh, still somebody here taking care of things on my left here also there's a, a field in which there are still things planted very nice very nice There's an old building. I don't know what uh, it would have been used for. Let's uh, get on a bit close, shall we? There's a water tank and uh, water installation here. Or maybe it's uh, gas? I don't know, it's, it's kind of uh, black there like uh, it has uh, some sort of oil or gas passing through I also don't know what's here but uh, I think I'm gonna try to find out if there's a, a hole in a window here no it's not I mean it is, but uh, it's way up here. 
gun. I don't think I can reach it. But I'll try. That's about it for uh, what's inside. I see some pipes. All these airplane and uh, helicopter noises you're hearing are uh, because of uh, the airfield being so close. Like I mentioned, Banasa Airport is uh, close. I believe this uh, provided some type of heat. I don't know. Is is a tower? I'm not about to scale it to see what's going on here, but it's uh, it's anchored right there from the ground and uh, as you can see there's another wire going there in that other part yeah I don't know what exactly is it but interesting nevertheless too bad they are uh, abandoned some plaques here it says uh, on that there it says no entry and uh, on this back here it says no smoking so I'm guessing it's uh, either uh, no smoking because uh, you will put the plant in danger or no smoking because uh, this building here produced some type of fuel biofuel I don't know I'm I'm just uh, I'm just guessing a very old building that uh, light fixture there is uh, rusty and uh, I haven't seen much of those around and yeah very interesting and uh, yeah I thought I couldn't be in here last year let me continue on this alley here it's not going uh, far enough right about there uh, is the end I thought I'm gonna see some uh, different things but yeah a lot of vegetation in these uh, greenhouses also you can see rows of uh, small trees growing and this is uh, where it ends abruptly I guess it uh, kind of continue back there but uh, the alley is hidden these were also uh, some uh, areas in which they cultivated things I'm not sure exactly what they uh, planted here there's uh, no greenhouse covering it and uh, these are some different types of uh, greenhouses as you can see here there's a there's an arch they're still made of metal but there's an arch compared to that uh, construction here which is a sort of a triangle yeah I'm guessing I'm guessing they were growing different things back there and make this uh, right turn I still have greenhouses on my left and on my right there's another uh, alley that goes back there but uh, I'm not gonna take it it's uh, a lot of vegetation these are also uh, beehives as you can see beehives look there's that uh, rounded construction I'm gonna let this chopper pass I think they are uh, doing flying lessons it kind of uh, did that when I was uh, last here so I'm guessing that they, they are doing flying lessons okay so uh, back at it these uh, arched ones that I saw back there also and I see here they clearly planted uh, different things inside another uh, greenhouse here let me see if there's something left inside yeah this is all there is left inside these were uh, the tables 
on which uh, the sprouts and uh, the plants would have uh, grown. This is all that's left. Yeah. I'm taking my time with this uh, orchard because uh, I'm not sure how, uh, how much time is gonna continue to exist in this very spot and uh, I want to preserve it for posterity. I want to remember this place and uh, as long as uh, YouTube will still exist this video is gonna be up. I'm gonna continue on this uh, wider alley here and on my right there's a uh, an abandoned house in uh, an advanced state of decay. The roof tiling is uh, sort of collapsing. I think there's still time to save this house, but I don't know, I haven't seen inside. Looks like it, though, from the outside. On my left, those uh, same triangular uh, greenhouses. This is an active building here, so uh, I'm not gonna stay too long in this spot. I'm gonna continue my uh, cruising. I don't know if this is uh, still used here. It looks a bit better. We are on that uh, other part of uh, the building from which we entered to first see the greenhouses. As I mentioned, this uh, is an active building. I can't quite remember what this is. I've uh, once checked it out on uh, Google Maps, but uh, I will put it on the screen. I'm gonna make a left turn here. And on my right, there's uh, another part of the orchard. This is somewhat taken care of and uh, not so much. So to speak, these trees over here, you see this, uh, this yellow thing on their barks. I think this is uh, a fungal infection. I'm not sure. Correct me if I'm wrong. Somebody in the comments who uh, knows what, I, what this uh, yellow thing is, let me know. There's another abandoned house here. I'm gonna get close to this one because uh, it's quite in the middle of the field. And there's a dog inside, so we've overwhelcomed our stay. Let's uh, get out of here. If there's a dog, there's uh, somebody living inside for sure. This uh, yellow structure here is part of uh, airport signaling. You can see back there in the distance, there's uh, our El Vlaico airport and these uh, are uh, exactly at uh, an angle for uh, the landing strip. A plane uh, is, uh, is gonna see them at night. If you keep on continuing exactly in this direction, you're gonna end up uh, at uh, the landing strip of our Elf Lyco airport, which is way, way back there on that other side of uh, this busy street. Then I wanna. Yeah, let me turn back. The sun's in my eyes. I can barely see in front. I'm gonna stop for a moment and show you this. This is part of uh, the old irrigation system. And uh, by the looks of it, and uh, by the level of uh, rustiness, I presume that uh, it's no longer used. And that's why uh, I believe that this part of the orchard is uh, somewhat abandoned. That chopper is uh, is back. I'm gonna try my luck here for a second and get on closer to these uh, to this house. I'm gonna go around through here. This part of the building was uh, not renovated like that other part back there. But uh, this one surely is. Oh yeah, now I remember. Now I remember what this is. In the Second World War, this house was uh, used by uh, a Romanian 
authorities as a headquarters. I don't want to overstate my welcome here. I don't see a guard booth, but uh, you never know. There's another abandoned house on the property and uh, another alley which is uh, going back there. Yeah, as I said, I don't want to overstate my welcome and uh, if there's a guard booth and uh, I'm not supposed to be in here, I'm not gonna push it. But I want to see if uh, I can uh, pass through those uh, arches first make this left turn and see what's back here as far as i can see it's a gate large trash bin i just passed ah, okay this is uh, another institute which uh, i'm sure i cannot enter in that yard there the institute for agricultural equipment in that uh, big building there on a turn back this whole area here including that uh, house there is uh, the research and development station for fruit tree growing this is another perspective of this uh, gorgeous house you look at this uh, of course there's a the chopper passing that same chopper passing right through here yeah, as i was saying the nice light fixture back here this is the main uh, door, I presume. The Romanian and the European Union flag on the left and on the right. Yeah. It's a very uh, old and nice building, architecturally speaking. This uh, other side is uh, sort of neglected but uh, not in a state of disrepair let me try something else which is uh, gonna be fun as well yeah those uh nice nice architectural uh, nice arches and uh, the ceiling is made out of wood. There's a barbecue here. Yeah, so let's get around on this uh, side of the building and take this uh, exit through here. Exit on the main uh, street. Almost at the exit. You can see some uh, agricultural equipment. I took it a bit slower than usual to take it all in and explore. This is a store here. Yeah, of course it is. They are selling these, uh, these trees and plants here. If you wanna buy them and uh, put it in your own garden. That's about it for uh, today's video. We're about to exit into civilization. A nice cruise through this uh, orchard here, which is uh, well maintained. This is one of the choppers, but uh, it's been messing up my, uh, my audio. I'm close to the airport, so there's not much else I can do. So that's about it for uh, today's video, guys. I had a lot of fun cruising through these uh, alleys of the orchard. It's uh, kind of sad that most of it is uh, decaying and uh, abandoned but it is what it is some of it is still standing and uh, is uh, active so yeah hit that like button if uh, you liked this video consider subscribing hit that subscribe button if you want to see more videos like this i thank you very much for watching and uh, i'll see you in the next one take care bye bye